Hi, Craig Peters here from Sound Iron, and today I'm going to be walking you through our Montclarian Hall Grand Piano version 2.0 update. The Montclarian Hall Grand Piano is a classic Steinway 1926 parlor grand that lives in one of our favorite recording halls. It's a uniquely curved A-frame chapel tucked high in the densely forested Oakland Hills that we've used to record a number of different sound iron libraries. It has a lush, rich, clear, well-defined, and balanced natural acoustic reflections. This hall just so happens to have a beautiful black Steinway 1926 parlor grand piano sitting in it. This magical room combined perfectly with this piano, creating the right tonal and spatial balance to create a lush, bright sound that felt both instantly inspiring and unique. It has a crisp, solid tone ideal for classical composing, yet works equally well for soul, jazz, rock, and pop. But this 7 plus gigabyte library goes well beyond a simple classical grand piano library. It also includes a wide selection of extended prepared piano and very useful creative effects articulations, such as percussive pounds, slams, string scrapes, steel guitar slides, mallet and pick glisses, sweeps, plucks, and much more. On the front of the UI, you'll see controls for tone, body, attack, release, release volume, offset, dynamics, and pedal volume. These controls give you the ability to shape the sound how you see fit. At the top left, you'll see the velocity range slider. This allows you to bracket the range to keep the dynamics under control, whether it be soft and gentle, bright, loud, or full range. To the right of that, you can open up the advanced tab, which gives you even more sound shaping controls with LFO, filter, and the built-in arpeggiator. Directly below this is the articulation drop-down window. Use this to select any of the available articulations from the classic grand piano, to mute and slide effects, to glisses and slams, and more. To the far right, you have the mic mixer with three mics at your disposal, including close, mid, and far positions. You can also control the output routing, as well as presence controls for each mic position. The Montclarian Hall piano has a ton of character and can go from very warm and emotional to bold and in your face. Now let's go ahead and play a little bit to get an idea of how this sounds. The library doesn't stop there. It also includes a variety of different articulations from mutes, slides, slams, player and sound effects, and ambiences. This can be very useful for layering or adding that creepy tension for more horror-styled film scoring.
You can also switch the different articulations using the red key switches to the left. If you want to take this piano sound to the next level, you can open up the Advanced tab to morph the sound in a multitude of ways. Let's experiment with this. You can use the mic mixer to place the piano wherever you'd like from up close and personal to very distant. You can even use all three to really give the sound a more three-dimensional texture. The library comes with the close mic enabled, but just so you know, when you do add the mid and far mic positions, you will see an increase in ramp. The library also comes with 20 custom effects presets to choose from. Use them as a creative starting point and experiment with them in your tracks. Let's go ahead and play through some of these.
This is all rounded out by our modular effects rack. The effects rack tab gives you direct access to 18 of Contact's built-in special effects and dynamic processors. This panel is accessible in all presets by clicking on the effects tab button at the bottom of the instrument UI. If you would like to learn more about the Montclarion Hall Grand Piano, please make sure to visit our website at soundiron.com. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you soon.